The Flying Flowers Butterfly Garden was created to bring awareness of endangered monarch butterflies while involving community action. They have worked with students at the Fountain Hills Charter School to help it earn schoolyard habitat certification from the National Wildlife Federation. They also worked with Mayor Jenny Dickey to sign a Mayor's Monarch Pledge proclamation. Nancy Stahl invited us into her backyard to share how we can offer water, shade, a safe habitat, and flowers for food to Arizona's wide range of butterflies. Flying Flowers Butterfly Garden in Fountain Hills. We've been, we established three years ago <clears throat> and we are looking at ways to uh, produce pollinator plants, save the monarch butterflies uh, from uh, extinction and educate people and children about planting, about caring for their uh, garden and uh, planting more milkweed, which attracts the uh, monarch butterflies and all butterflies it's a pollinator plant but particularly the monarchs they have uh, been in decline and now they're down to uh, 10 percent of what they used to be which was in the millions that's why have you seen a monarch this summer i saw one yesterday used to see tons of them, lots of them all over the place. Used to lay down in the clover field and watch them fly over me. They were wonderful. Now they're uh, disappearing rapidly. So we need to really be energetic and get out there and start planting and preserving these beautiful, beautiful insects. Jenny Dickey, who is our mayor, and Grady Miller, who is uh, our um, town manager has given us a proclamation for November being butterfly month and uh, so uh, every month of November we can have a festival and celebrate monarchs as well as other insects. We are uh, interested in preserving pollinators like uh, butterflies, bees, birds, and blooms. And that's our whole purpose of uh, preserving in the area. We are, uh, we do need donations. So uh, if you are interested in contacting us, uh, our uh, information is available uh, on, uh, our, uh, on our website, which is being built right now, and, uh, or our email addresses everyone would make an effort to stop using pesticides. It would be a huge step towards saving these beautiful creatures. So plant your gardens. We'll help you plant. Let us know what you are interested in. We'll look for ideas for you and help you to create what we've created here, which will help to uh, preserve them as well. Our team is uh, Ellen Wright, who is our president. Myself, Nancy Paul, uh, who is a secretary treasurer, uh, uh, Lisa Ristusha, and uh, Joe Gear. Joe Gear is our plant guy. Lisa is our contact, uh, a, a consultant, as she's involved with many gardens around the area and a, a school teacher. So we have a good start, but we need more people. So please give us a call, write us. Uh, make sure that uh, we can help you and we will make sure that we can help you. Thank you so much. Another thing that uh, I want to mention is the beautiful butterfly rendering that is going to be available with when we are free to move about. And it's all butterflies uh, on a wall, uh, an acre wall in the park. It's all variety of butterflies, including monarchs, that will be coming through here to migrate and go to California or Mexico. So we're very excited about that wall and we'll be doing gardening under it so that uh, it will be a uh, really beautiful destination to visit in the park of Fountain Hills.